uh, Red Bear Man. Um, I just uh, installed a kitty cat uh, into this Mac. Actually, that's a hard drive. I ran it through the yeah. duplicator. And uh, that Mac is fixed. This one is almost done. I uh, work a lot of hours. I like my job. And I'm doing a video of the cat to start with because they're cute. But let me go over here. Um, I was confronted by a lot of people. And uh, they would say, you should do this, you should do that. And I hate it when people should on me. <laughs> they should not should on me. <clears throat> uh, but here's the deal. I, you know, years ago I used to drink a lot. Drank like a fish, man. And my life was really messed up. Uh... So I, I kept telling myself in my 20s, there goes the cat, bye kitty, um, that I'd never be that bad, and I got worse, and then, you know, I, I, I'd see my dad the way he was, and, you know, here I am making a YouTube video talking about this shit, uh, because what happened was there were some newcomers that I talked to that were, like, fresh, trying to get, like, clean and sober and stuff. I was hanging out at the pier. And I was sitting with them for like hours, and uh, um, they were struggling. And uh, I mentioned uh, that I work a lot of hours, my health insurance doubled, and I don't qualify for Medicaid and all that. And a lot of a lot of people said you should apply, blah blah blah. But I've already been there. I've had Mutual of Omaha for years, man, 26 years, and then they switched over to I had Kaiser Permanente and then uh, Pacific Care. They had their office off of uh, somewhere near Rock Remen, not far from HP. So anyway, long video, but uh, bottom line is that uh, I shared with these newcomers about how when my dad was drinking and I was younger, I said I'd never, ever get that bad, but I got worse. And then when my uh, uh, when I was older, uh, my dad you know, took his life, killed himself. And he wasn't thinking about the kids, man. I was like in between the tug of war between my mom and dad. My dad was, you know, so busy trying to be right all the time. You know, I'd rather be happy. You know, maybe I'm right, you know, with software, but I'd rather be happy. And so, I, you know, oh boy, what a day. So I'm, I'm over here uh, trying to figure something out with these uh, machines. Uh, the uh, silver one. You have to do a reflow on the NVIDIA card. So anyway. Um, I know about computers, I know about binary, but as far as trying to interact with people on like a norm, in a normal way, I've always struggled with that, so that's why I drank. So I don't drink anymore, and so here I am making a YouTube video talking about the shit that happened in my life, because I was way out there, man. I lived in Elgin, Illinois, living under a bridge in a cardboard box for a while. A lot of my family members did not know about it, they just knew I was not around. I smelled like wine. I smelled like vomit. And so here I am, you know, I got my act together, got clean and sober, moved to Colorado in a car I bought for $21. So anyway, no said, I just wanted to, to get the word out because uh, these newcomers that I talked to said they had issues with their parents and their dad and whatever. And so I was able to use my past as an asset instead of a liability. So. Yeah, maybe my past is just, you know, dark and, you know, deadly as, as, as what it was or what it is. But now it's an asset instead of a liability. So I have to look for the cat. And now I have to reload the Mac and do all that. Yes, long video.